Hey, hey, welcome to Poe Boy World of Games. Today's another look in Terraria with our boy Poe Knightley, and we're gonna finish the rocket. Since the last video, I dug a lot. I, I'll show you in a second here. I basically dug straight down from the rocket and got all kinds of rock stone. I also, if you remember, I told you I was gonna remove that snow hill. Well, it's gone. So I have tons of snow, I've got tons of stone, and I can finish the rocket. Should be able to fix it, finish the rocket. So most of the rooms are constructed. It's time to fill it in with some background wall and light it up. So far I think that looks pretty cool. I'll probably put something on the table for light, like a candle or whatever, just to make sure everything is actually lit up. But so far, I'm really liking that, that palm chandelier. Considering that's a snow block background, it looks very similar to that stone. I don't know that I want to keep the doors in that location. In my original design, I had put it about in the middle of the room, and that would keep the NPCs from running all around. So I think I might still do that, but I can always do that later. In the center section... Ooh, because I beat the eye, the Dryad showed up. She might have just moved into one of those houses I just built. What was I saying? I don't remember what I was saying. Oh, in the center section... I think I'm going to use red brick wall because it kind of looks like, you know, where the rocket fuel would go in the center of the, of the rocket or missile. That'll require digging out some clay, turning the clay into brick, and then the brick into brick wall or background wall. Okay, so now I'm going to go make some platforms. I should have made those at the beginning, but, you know... Do I have palm wood still? I do have palm wood. I probably could have just built them right here, huh? Yep, I sure could. All right, that's the bulk of the missile. And there's our dryad living in the middle of it. So uh, should, it should be pretty clear then that these uh, side houses going vertically are uh, suitable housing. For this one, this one is also. This one up here is gonna be mine. And I think I'm gonna put a bed up here somewhere. Speaking of bed, let's go make some stuff. Last time, I got some demonite ore. I killed the eye and got some demonite ore. So now let's put that to good use. There it is. Demonite bar. What did I make? I made 14. Now I'm going to make the lights bane because that's going to be a requirement or an ingredient in the uh, what is it the Knight's Edge so 
I'm gonna start with that plus it does 18 damage versus my 13 so my gold sword can be sold now let's reassign that to the d-pad how about that yeah that's cool all right so what else did I want to make I'm gonna make some more torches because I need more torches for light I'm gonna go ahead and put palm wood in the box I'll use regular wood Tons of torches. Okay, so I also want to build the loom because the loom will allow me to make my bed. So let's put down the loom and the cobwebs I'd mentioned in the past for trying to create or trying to uh, gather. That is how I will make fabric, silk, whatever. I don't remember how much I need for a bed, but We'll just make it all into it. Okay, so let's see. What kind of bed can I make? Just a bed. Let's see if I can do something like palm or boreal. I don't think ebon wood is enough, but we'll take a look. Show me a cool bed. I guess I have to be closer to this. I don't know what I need to be. The sawmill. Okay. There's the palm. There's the boreal. We'll keep with the palm theme. Now what's really cool is I should be able to set my spawn point. I can't remember if I need a table and chair, but... Nope. Spawn point is set. This is where I will spawn now. And now that it's nighttime, I can see there are holes in my roof. Not really the roof, but the wall? Oops, wrong brick. How about that one? They look so similar. There we go. Snow brick wall. And... There. Is that good? That looks good. Now my spawn point is set, so when I run around, I'm in my little rocket nose cone thing. Now I can reassign all of these NPCs to rooms inside my tower, my rocket, and I can demolish that little building. I still gotta move these steps back a little bit take this down a couple and uh, then I'll start building the rest of the silo out of something else but I think I'll call it quits for now I've got a pretty good head start on everything I need to do and uh, if you like this drop a like comment subscribe and I will talk to you guys later po boy out